Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today I'm reading for the astrological sign of Capricorn from November 16th through the 30th. Um, as we have spoken before, you know, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate with you. Take what you like, leave the rest. I want to thank the people who have been subscribing and who have also been coming to my Facebook and or Instagram channels. I really appreciate that. If you haven't subscribed, please below, please subscribe. Um, it's real, you know, it's real important. Um, you know, it, it tells me that, you know, that I am reaching people that want to continue and it's very positive for me. Um, please subscribe again below like if you don't like then please it's okay i won't be a hurt go on and find another reader there's a lot of us out there on on youtube somebody will you know meet your needs okay again this is for capricorn november 16th through the 30th also um since the time i read for you last i have completed my reiki master my reiki 3 master trainer course and so I have infused this, these decks with Reiki energy. So I hope you find that my um, readings are a little crisper for you. Um, I really have seen it for myself, so I hope that you see that also. Um, we will be starting with, no, 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 not those. We will be using my Doreen Virtue Angel Tarot cards. My Psychic Tarot and Oracle cards. Also to my Osha Zen tarot cards, okay? And like I said, I have infused, I have meditated and infused these with Reiki energy. And let's see now, what does Capricorn need to know? And this is for your rising, ascending, and or moon. And, you know, so if you, if, if this isn't quite, you know, look to see what your, you know, look to see what your other signs are and go and watch those videos also. They can actually provide a completer picture for you, okay? So what does Capricorns need to know for November 16th through the 30th? Oh, okay, come on. What do they need to know? Give it another couple more shuffles, see if anything wants to come out. Okay, nothing is coming out, okay. We're going to cut the deck. Oh, okay. Take our first three cards. Let's paste out right now. And let's see what we have. Let's see. Let's put the glasses on. Helps to see a little bit. Again, um, I'm an intuitive reader, channeler, so I will show you the cards, tell you what actually is what that's saying, and then, you know, because I do believe in the exchange of energy. That's, again, you know, why I work with Reiki, um, or Reiki works through me. And, um, you know, I think that um, the more we share, the more we connect, the better it is for us to give a, you know, a better reading for you. So now, first card that comes up, Six of Fire. Victory, good news. Yay is on its way. Public recognition or awards. Um, somebody going for a promotion. I'm feeling kind of promotion. I'm feeling kind of, you know, I'm feeling a promotion. Okay. So, or you're going for a job that's a little bit higher than what you've been doing. So let's see what the second card is. Knight of Earth. Time to buckle down and get things done. Honor your commitments. A guardian angel. Again, Capricorn is an earth sign. I feel that this is you. So basically, in order for you to get that promotion or get that whatever that level is, I'm feeling like you have been here and now you're going up to here. You are leveling. I mean, you are going up a level. I'm hearing, you know, ascending. You're going up another level. And in order to do that, you really need to um, you really need to show whoever this is that you are worthy of this. However. You are somebody that's going to go ahead and, you know, and buckle down and you are going to be somebody who, you know, you're actually getting, you know, a guardian angel that's watching and that's going to be guiding you through this. So now let's see what this third card is. Three of water, a celebration, a wedding, graduation or birth announcement, the need to have more fun. I, I again, I'm feeling like promotion. I'm feeling promotion. Now, if you're in school, it could be that you're graduate at, 
not graduating. It could be that that class that's been so hard is actually a class that want, you know that you actually pass, and you're like, how the heck did I do that? Or it could be that you're graduating, or it could be that um, you know, you know, are we are we thinking of getting engaged? I really feel it's more career oriented, but it's something along those lines. I feel like it's you know, I feel. Um, I feel it's more career, but then we have, you know, it's a celebration, a wedding, graduation, birth announcement, okay? Um, you know, so whatever this is, that it, it culminates in a celebration with for you. It culminates, even if it's just you going out and saying, here's to me. It basically is something that you have been, you know, you've been working towards, you know, you still have to buckle down to get through that. But you're going to get that and it's actually going to be like, wow, look at what you did. Great. I mean, you know, I mean, how much more can I really, I can keep talking about it, but, you know, let's, let's go on and see. I'm going to use my Psychic Tarot Oracle cards. Can you clarify a little bit for Capricorns? November 16th through the 30th. Now, you know, Capricorns too, it could just be... Maybe even if you're in a difficult situation right now in the home, um, that it could be that things actually, you know, actually settle down. Um, but I really, I really feel it's more of a money issue, and I feel like it's more of a job or career issue. And, and it might, you know, you know, if it is a school issue, it's basically you're gonna, you know, like if it's. Um, you know, like I was watching, you know, Legally, you know, was it Legally, Legally, Legally Blonde, where she got into, you know, Harvard and like, oh, what, is it hard? But it, that would in itself would be a celebration. So I, I really feel like it's good news coming to you. And it could be that, that if you're in school and you're waiting to get into a different, a new college or a new school, it could be that, that you're going to hear really good things, that yes, it's going to happen. However, you still do need to... Um, you need to take it seriously and not think, well, just because Deb said it was going to happen, it's going to happen because, you know, you need to still do your work. You need to still do your prep work because you're the king, you're the knight of earth. So, okay, so we got our three cards. The first one is the waiting game. I think that, you know, I think it's something that you've actually been waiting for. I think it's something that you actually know what this is about and you're waiting for it. You know, if it is a promotion, if it is a, you know, something that you're waiting for a new, you know, new job or something, you've been waiting for it. Um, this was reversed. So this means, you know, it is a, you know, you are, it is going to be actually something that's going to be good for you. And actually, I feel like it's going to act um, to balance you out. It's going to be something that, you know, maybe you've been underappreciated. Maybe you have been, you know, you have felt that, you know, I, you know, sometimes you can be in a job that doesn't necessarily, and I don't know why, I, I really feel Capricorn that this is job type related, okay? But, you know, where you're like, you know, I, you know, I'm, I could do this job in my sleep. I need a little bit more um, challenge, but yet, you know, I really feel that this is something that, um, yeah, yeah, I, you know, you're going to come into a better place with this job. Okay, I, I feel it's a job. I feel it's a job. You've been waiting for it. It's actually going to balance you out, and it's time for you. And you know, and you're going to be moving into it. You're going into the light. You're not, you know, you're going from the dark into the light. So whatever this is that you're going into, it's going to be a better fit for you. It, you know, people are going to recognize that you do really well with this and they're going to just love you with this. And it is going to be like now you are meeting, you know, you are now where you need to be. Okay. And I, I feel like this has been kind of, I haven't, I've given you kind of this message before. I, I feel like this has been a message that, is just, you know, it just keeps going down that road. I feel like we've, you know, when I do these, I try, I really don't review my prior ones because I want this to be fresh, but I really feel this is something Capricorn. It's like you keep moving into your better place. And that's a good thing. I really appreciate that for you because you're very hardworking people. 
and you know you 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 really you know you're hard working and you're you know I salt of the earth salt of the earth what your know, earth sign but I'm feeling like the salt of the earth okay so um okay let's go to my Osha Zantero what final words do we have for um Capricorn I think that we're kind of getting the same it's been you know so Capricorn you're in this season that you know I really feel haven't that this is something that I've been telling you um but let's go on okay Last final words for Capricorn. And what this means then, if this, if I am correct and I've been telling you the same message, it just means it continues to unfold. You know, since we are going, you know, two weeks at a time, it's not like, you know, oh, I won, oh, I became a princess last time. Oh, I, I uh, you know, oh, I was the queen of the Netherlands. Um, and now this time I'm now winning the lotto. Now that's not how this works, so. It's, you know, so let's see. Come on, what else do we want to tell them? Anything else? Any last card? I have two cards that have come up. They both have been upside down or reversed. They weren't upside down, they were reversed. Nothing else is coming down, and I actually think that these cards are what we need to hear. So, Participation. Look at the look at the um, you know look at the glow. Look at the colors. Look at the lights that are coming through this because of what you have been doing, because of the work that you've been putting in. And you know, again, uh, um, definite my definition of luck is op, uh, preparation to meet opportunity. But because you have been doing your legwork, because you have been putting in your time, you have been buckling down. You know, you have been the salt of the earth. You have been doing the things that you're going to be doing. You know, you're going to be moving on. Again, I think it's the same job, though. Maybe it's going to be a different job, but same career type. You know, if, you know, if you're a nurse, um, you know, medical, then you go into just same, you know, it's still medical, but it's like, at a, you know, I feel like you're stepping, you know, going up the stairs, okay? You're, you're climbing that ladder. And your last one is rebirth. You know, so with this one, you know, here it is. You know, here you are, you're coming out of the gray. You're you're coming into your authority. You're 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 being led again. You know, they were talking here, where was it that we were talking about having your guardian angel? You know, you're being led into a new place and it is a higher level place it is a promotion it is something that is more suited for your talents it's something where people will say this is the right you know this is, you are now in the right place now this is all coming back coming this is all unraveling for you and i think you know i'm you know i'm thinking that this is also going to be yeah, you know, while this is all coming, put being, I feel like this is all being put in, put in place, and I think that it, you know, again, it might be put in place to begin with on uh, in January, yeah, you know, because this is the end of the year, but it's all coming, and it's all coming together for you. Okay, so, okay, so Capricorn, this is great. I really think that it's coming together for you. You're going to be happier. You're going to be. You know, people are going to see you better, not better. They're going to see you for all that you contribute because you're really salt of the earth, salt of the earth. That's what I'm hearing. Okay. So Capricorn, have a great Thanksgiving. Enjoy that this is all unraveling, for, not unraveling, but this is all, well, it's unraveling, but it's not unraveling like a, you're taking knitting apart. It's actually falling into place. It's all, all the steps are being put out there for you to just walk on okay have a great thanksgiving subscribe below and i will talk to you in december or before december okay and please follow me on facebook and instagram okay you have a great great month okay bye bye <laughs>